Hello guys, welcome to another video from DVP's Ones. Do not forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon so that you get the notifications. Hi guys, welcome to another video from DVP's Ones. This is Dheeraj Jipadal from DVP's Ones. So today I'm gonna explain you. So in this video I'm gonna explain you many things of coal like the stages of coal formation, the coal, uh, how the coal formation is brought out, uh, is actually happened, and how do we differentiate different forms or stages of coal, and how heat and pressure affect it using, you know, this PPD presentation. So let's start the video. A boom. Hello, so this is the PPT call formation with explanation from DVP. So first, stages of call formation. So many people know it, so I'm going to explain it with a diagram, writings, text and many things. So, call formation. So, huge forest grew around 300 million years ago, covering most of it. You know this. Earth was covered with trees all over the earth with water and trees and natural beauty 300 million years ago. Next, the vegetation dies and forms peat. So, the vegetation here are referring to animals, trees, plants, small grass. Everything obviously dies because of the swamp and then this formed the first layer which is peat. So, next comes the peat is compressed between sediment layers to form lignite. Lignite is like the next stage of coal. So peat is the first stage. So the next the next stage is lignite. We will uh, we'll come to the part uh, next where I explain each of the layers. So first we finish this and then go to the next. So uh, it, uh, the peat is compressed between the sediment and layers to form lignite. So you know what are sediments? Sediments are the particles who settle down when you, you know, inter, uh, uh, in a mixture of solid dissolved in a liquid. So the, uh, the heavy particle uh, settle down and are called sediments. So next, further compression forms bituminous and sub bituminous coal so bituminous is the next stage of uh, uh, you know coal formation so i'm gonna explain all the four types of layers peat lignite bituminous and anthracite so I, i'm gonna ex explain all the layers in a while so further compression forms bituminous and sub bituminous coal so next and the last level is Eventually, anthracite forms. So, th this is a fun fact. Anthracite is the most costliest and A1 quality coal. It's like the best quality of coal ever formed. Yeah, that's why it has a high value in the market. Anthracite, yeah. Remember, anthracite. Remember, anthracite is the costliest coal. Okay, so next, let's uh, move to the next section. How heat and pressure affects it. So you see this diagram. This is plants uh, 300 billion years ago. You know I explained it. So next layer is peat. So the how heat, time and pressure affects it. So this is peat over here. So next comes the lignite. How it comes. You can see these many layers of soil is above the peat. So this is like a common sense question. If you uh, put these many layers of soil above or something, heat pressure is outputted obviously. So heat and pressure is output around the peat. So by absorbing heat and pressure, heat and pressure again and again by time passes, the peat gets converted into lignite. So now comes the lignite. Next. Again, the process go on. More layers come. More heat and pressure comes. So again, it goes to bituminous and then anthracite and then coal. So this is like how heat and pressure affect it. So uh, I hope you understand. Heat 
is uh, obviously done because of the earth's core and pressure is because of the amounts of uh, uh, layers of soil that come above the old soil that is the peat lignite coal and stuff so we humans dig this path hole dig through and take this coal over here so this is how coal mining actually happens so let's go to the next section so this is a section where i explain you different uh, stages of coal formation how we differentiate different forms of coal so as said this is peat you know the first layer of peat which i show you like here see here peat this layer so i'm going to explain it to you now so peat peat is a little brown layer of soil and one thing we uh, the question is how how do we dif differentiate different forms of coal we mainly differentiate different forms of coal on the basis of the percentage of carbon yeah remember this this is a very very important fact carbon so we differentiate many layers of coal from the amount of carbon okay first is peat you can pause the video so and uh, take the screenshot if you want the table or something so it is a little brown layer which consists of 50 to 60 percent carbon it is like the first layer of coal so when we apply heat and pressure to it again and again so we come to lignite lignite is a brown not little brown brown so brown layer of soil it consists of 60 to 70 percent it is like an ascending order first 50 to 60 then 60 to 70 then it increases so this is a little more efficient and more essential than peat uh, because guy guess why because it's like common sense because the amount of carbon is more than compared to peat it, here it is 50 to 60 percent here it is 60 to 70 percent so this is more essential and effective so next comes the bituminous bituminous is a color change you know like it's black in color yeah black in color and this is uh, obviously you know more effective than the lignite because it has 70 to 80 percent carbon yeah 70 to 80 percent carbon so next comes the boss of all the anthracite so why do I call it a boss? I said you first. It is the costliest and uh, you know most uh, A one quality coal. So uh, many people will having the question why it is the richest. Here you have the answer. It is a dark layer layer and it consists of more than ninety to ninety nine percent carbon. Just imagine ninety to ninety nine percent carbon. So this makes it. The A1 quality and richest layer of soil. Okay. So, yeah. So, the PPT is finished. Thank you. So, I hope you saw the PPT. So, please comment uh, on the PPT if you liked it or something. I just did it on PowerPoint, uh, PowerPoint 2007. So, you can do it in your laptop or sometimes even in phone. The app is there. So even you can create a uh, um, PPT like this. So please do not forget to subscribe the button. Subscribe and click the bell icon just beside it. And like if you learned something new today. Comment and share the video. Do you be signing out. The next video. Wait, wait, wait. Don't end the video. The next video is on uh, co carbon and its compound.